Hi, welcome to itvideopod.com. Um, this is uh, Google Earth. I'm sure you've all all seen it by now. If not, you certainly should have. Um, inc incredibly uh, successful service. Anyway, today I was reading um, a popular blog, Riley.com, and. I was reading about the the Google I/O conference, which was on the 28th to the 29th of May, and Google unveiled a Google Earth API and uh, various plugins for web browsers. So, what does this mean? Well, I've already installed it. This is for uh, on Firefox for Windows, and as you can see, we have Google Earth running in a web browser. So what does the API mean? Well it means we're going to have lots of really um, f funky new services basically whole host new services. Um, I've seen sites and, c and current s services building Google Earth extension as extensions to their, to their current services uh, and integrating in various ways. Um, if I go to some example sites, all these all these sites will be in in the article that follows. Um, here we've got a, a bog, bog, what are called the bog standard example template. Um, I can type in a location, for example, New York. Go to that location. So as you can see, it basically it works. Um, it it works like uh, Google Maps. But obviously requires a plugin to get the 3D effects. Um, very, very similar to Microsoft's Virtual Virtual Earth, um, which has actually been available as a plugin for quite a while now. But I expect some really good things on the AP side, um, API side of this. If we go to this other site, here's another example. Okay, which actually lists some of the the, the the properties that we can actually change. So, for example, if I click um, Total Sky, for example, the codes appeared here. We run that code, and we've switched into uh, the sky mode, and we can see stars and constellations. Um, Total it again. We're, we're back in ordinary mode. Um, if I uh, zoom in, where are we? <laughs> um, if I if I zoom in, we can t toddle the the terrain again. It writes the code here in this example, and we've got a different terrain uh, view. Okay, so that's just some examples. Um, we can do some really crazy things if you look at this a game which has been developed by the Google Earth plugin. This is really cool. Um, this is actually driving a virtual milk truck through Google Earth. Oops. Anyway, you get the get the picture, even though I'm not very good at this. Um, I would have actually liked a better example, um, perhaps uh, them driving this down the various streets of, of New York. But I presume there's a a performance trade-off at the moment. But anyway, it's a really nice example of what can be achieved. So anyway. This is the Google Earth API and Google Earth plugin, as seen at the Google I/O conference. Um, remember, all the all the uh, website addresses are available in the the article that follows at itvideopod.com, and um, I hope to see you there.